श्री बीबी पाटिल बीबी पाटिल सर सर जो सुमार को जवाब पटल पर रखा श्री दयानिधि मारन थैंक यू स्पीकर सर सर आप मिनिस्टर इज वेरी डायनामिक मिनिस्टर एंड ही हैज ऑल द डेटा इन हिज एंड आई जस्ट फॉर फिंगर टिप्स आई जस्ट ऑन आस्क यू सर दिस यूर डूइंग दिस पायलट प्रोजेक्ट about two parts the first part is this how you ensure that when you lay these fibers you don't expand the roads again so that these fibers don't get affected and is this fibers which are laying for the on the along with the national highways will it used be exclusively for the national highway program or will it also be leased out to other private operators like into the isps and other service providers so part b since bangalore has been mentioned and uh, i'm sir uh, we have been making a severe request for you so recently i had a opportunity to travel to ranipet from chennai it the roads are pathetic so all the land has been given by the state government the expansion work is all all lands are but your contractors have gone to the court for the last 4 years sir the chennai bengaluru highway is in a mess it takes nearly more to cross uh, say sir 100 kilometers it takes 4 and a half hours this is a very pathetic state so i know you will come and tell me that because all the contractors have got to court sir what is this process how, how do you overcome it So why should a common man or why should the people of Tamil Nadu suffer? Because your contractors or your people are not able to make sure, ensure that these contractors fall in line. So please ensure that these projects are completed on time. Thank you, sir. Honorable Chairman, sir. Basically, the problem related with the Chennai-Bangalore Express Highway, I just got opportunity to visit on the site. The problem is not with my department. here i need your cooperation for that aggregate is not available sometime the permission given for 3 month after 3 month again to get new permission is a difficult task then there is no permission for mining also there is a big problem then how we can make the roads the problem is land acquisition is a problem environment forest clearance is not there still bangalore side express highway is really the progress is very good the steel as tamil nadu we don't have land we don't have clearances then how the contractor are going to work for that that is to be a big problem i am really thankful for you that i need your cooperation particularly i want to work for tamil nadu we have lot of projects many time i explain it to the honorable member of parliament and many time i have given my representation to honorable chief minister also that as far as without land without environment clearance how it is possible for us to construct the roads so exactly i am with you uh, we want to complete this chennai bangalore express highway and actually my target is to complete this project up to end of this december this year this will take from chennai to bangalore 2 hours and actually i at time i visited bangalore to mysore the work is completed in next month prime minister is uh, we are uh, uh, talking with the pmo taking date for that and it will be only one hour from bangalore to mysore i understand the importance of the road and 100% we will try our level best to clear it but also your cooperation will be there it will be a great thing for me to complete the project regarding this delhi mumbai express highway regarding this is a greenfield express highway yes i am telling you that Well, we are working on that about uh, our mandate is only to construction of road but now in many times petroleum minister they need land acquisition for making of gas pipeline making of petrol and diesel other thing they need they are making lot of big project then there is some of the optic fiber the other department are doing lot of work the idea is experimentally for a pilot project we are doing two projects one is delhi mumbai expressway greenfield expressway and the other is hyderabad bangalore industrial corridor that is brownfield expressway we have already appointed the agency andhra pradesh urban infrastructure asset management limited appointed by our nhlml that is the organization in our nhi and now the planning is that the cost is very high because it comes in crores 6 to 7 crore rupees per kilometer the idea is we can take a, make a duct where we can make a petroleum pipeline we can make it fiber line also there there will be pipe pvc pipe or the ldp pipe or hdp pipe for using for optic fiber cable then we can use electric cable also and that can be easy because we don't need any land for that because already acquisition is there we can save the money on that 
So, Prime Minister program on Gati Shakti, we have to create cooperation, coordination and communication between the stakeholders. On the basis of that we are doing, but now I am thankful for Honorable Member to ask me this question. Now we are framing the policy, whether it is possible to work on DOT. If the private people can invest the money in duct, and then we can give the services to the concerning department, it can be 100% whether it is possible or not. But because of today, when I was taking the briefing, we have taken a decision to formulate the policy on PPP mode. If it is not economically viable on PPP mode, we can make it in hybrid annuity mode. We will finance some subsidy for that. But this is the need of the hour. Because as far as the target of our government is concerned regarding the popularity of internet and other things, it is very important. And I feel that this is the time that our target is to make the optic fiber cable up to 50 lakh kilometer. So we, have, we need to connect villages also. And because of 5G also, there is a great importance for that. We are working on the process, but basically my work, my mandate is only for road construction. That is with the IT ministry and other ministries are there. But and we have the land is ready. In Delhi Mumbai Express Highway, we have a land available 120 meter. The one lane is only 3.5 meter. We are first stage making only eight lane. We can go up to 16 lane. Still, we can give land for a uh, bullet train. Today, tomorrow, even we, if they want to start bullet, work, bullet train work from Delhi to Mumbai, land is available. We are also thinking on line of hyperloop and something. And also the Delhi Jaipur Highway, the first time the Prime Minister is going to inaugurate at 12, where we are planning for making of e-highway. From Delhi to Jaipur, the electric cable will be there. And the futuristic technologies are concerned. The idea is our truck and buses like the train, they're taking the advantage of that cable and going through Delhi to Jaipur. We are working on that. And that is also a first pilot project. I don't know whether how it can going to be get success. But it is a first trial for that. I'm very much thankful you, for you for asking me this question. And again, I humbly request you, all members of Tamil Nadu, in your constituency regarding NHI work, please cooperate us. We want to do it. Yeah.